The asteroid that slammed into the moon 3.8 billion years ago, creating the Imbrian Basin, may have had a diameter of at least 150 miles, according to a new estimate. The work helps explain puzzling geological features on the moon's near side and has implications for understanding the evolution of the early solar system. For any marketing course that requires the development of marketing plans such as marketing management, marketing strategy, and segmentation support marketing, this is the only planning handbook that guides students through the step-by-step -step creation of customized marketing plan, while offering commercial software to aid in the process. As we progress into the 21st century, communications are becoming faster and faster and faster. Think of the millions of different media images you are bombarded with every day. It is as important now to be able to read and make sense of those images as it has been to be able to read the ordinary text.
Electronic discourse is one form of interactive electronic communication. In this study, we reserve the term for the two-directional texts in which one person using a keyboard writes language that appears on the sender's monitor and is transmitted to the monitor of a recipient who responds by keyboard. Although it hails from a remote region of the western Himalayas, this plant now looks entirely at home on the banks of English rivers. Brought to the UK in 1839, it quickly escaped colonized river banks and damp woodlands. Now it is spreading across Europe, New Zealand and Canada. In the Himalayas, the plant is held in check by various pests, but take these away and it grows and reproduces unhindered. The quest for a user-friendly copyright regime began a decade ago when the Hong Kong government launched a public consultation on copyright protection in digital environment in December 2006. Although this consultation initially sought to address internet related challenges, such as those caused by peer-to-peer -peer file sharing technology, the reform effort quickly evolved into a more comprehensive digital upgrade of the Hong Kong copyright regime.
How quickly is the world's population growing? In the United States and other developed countries, the current growth rate is very low. In most developing countries, the human population is growing at 3 people per second. Because of this bustling growth rate, the human population is grown to reach 9 billion within your lifetime. Surprisingly, despite what appear to be infinite variations, all difficult conversations share a common structure. When you're caught up in the details and anxiety of a particularly difficult conversation, this structure is hard to see. But understanding that structure is essential to improving how you handle your most challenging conversations. There is a long history of rulers and governments trying to legislate on men's hair, both the length of the hair on their heads and the style of facial hair. For practical reasons, Alexander the Great insisted his soldiers be clean-shaven, but Peter the Great of Russia went further, insisting no Russians had beards.
Early in the 19th century, Wordsworth opposed the coming of the steam train to the Lake District, saying it would destroy its natural character. Meanwhile, Blake denounced the dark satanic mills of the Industrial Revolution. The conservation of the natural environment, however, did not become a major theme in politics until quite recently. In the distribution of wealth, America is more unequal than most European countries. The richest tenth of the population earns nearly six times more than the poorest tenth. In Germany and France, the ratio is just over three to one. The United States also has the largest proportion of its people in long-term poverty. Chaucer was probably the first English writer to see the English nation as a unity. This is the reason for his great appeal to his contemporaries. A long war with France had produced a wave of patriotism, with people no longer seeing each other as Saxon or Norman, but as English.
What can history tell us about contemporary society? Generally, in the past, even in Europe until the 18th century, it was assumed that it could tell how any society should work. The past was the model for the present and the future. It represented the key to the genetic code by which each generation produced its successors and ordered their relationships. 